Good morning guys, it's Monday. I thought I'd start another weekly vlog. It's actually European Gay Ski Week here, so 1950 is hosting that. Everyone went out last night and I didn't because I just couldn't, but um, it ended up being like 55 euro entry anyway. We might be doing the luge today, which is like this really long toboggan sled ride from the top of the mountain and it actually looks quite scary, like it's carved out. And when you go over it in the chairlift, um, you always see people like literally flipping over, like banging into each other, flipping off the side. I thought I'd do you a quick room tour um, because we kind of just half cleaned. Like the room is not clean. We need to do more, <laughs> a lot more. So this is where you come in and we have like a massive, God knows how many coats we need for girls, but we have um, all of our coats here. I'll show you the bathroom first. So it's still very dirty. Also, we broke our toilet seat twice, like, don't, don't even ask. But this is our bathroom, it's really, it's just quite, like, nice and modern and clean now, anyway. <laughs> There's not much to it, just, like, a shower, sink, shelf. This one is clean and my eyeshadow palette broke all over the floor. And then we have, like, all of this storage here that, again, needs cleaning. So this is mine and Silv's, all this bit. This is M's and Ass's bit. And um, this is us's. So I've got the few there. We've got a mirror here. Like a little full body length one. And then bunk beds. So just so you guys know, we actually pay £835 rent for this room a month. It's crazy. Um, so I'm literally paying £835 for a bunk bed. Down here there's like more storage. All stuff we need to sort out. And our balcony, which is the favourite bit. That's what I meant the other day when I was like, usually you can see a mountain here and it was just white. This is our balcony. So yeah, then this is my bed. I've just put all my sheets in the wash. Um, but this is my bed. I've got some cute Polaroids up. And some pictures from nights out. So I'm going to go out now. Dinner service at six, so I've got to be back at like five, half five to get ready. Um, but I'm going to go meet some people, do some shopping. So, hey guys, um, we're at Vary, and um, we're about to go up Aggie Road, all the way up to the top, to the tippity toppity, to the tatery tottery. <laughs> Bye guys, we'll do a transition. Are we missing it? Never mind. <laughs> it's not on well. How do you know? Because you haven't pressed record. Oh. <laughs> okay. Mr. Agro. None of this content's gonna be good because you're giving it. Oh. Here she comes. Big Aggie. 3,200 meters. That's quite high. She's a lot slower than I thought. Yeah, yeah. As if we go up that high. We live in 1950, so that's double the meters. <laughs> Isn't it? Uh, yeah. Yeah? I think so. No. 3226. <laughs> Is it not double where we live? 1950. Double that would be 4,000, wouldn't it? Well, nearly. 3,900. You can tell she doesn't do maths, can't you? Oh. And we go up to the top we go. Oh, oh you can come back down as well. Okay. Shotgun this space. Whoa. Guys, that view. Look at that view. You filmed yourself on the easy belt. 
Look at me skin. Oh, yeah. You did, you filmed yourself on the easy bit. I did, I was like <laughs> If you got me that I'd look sick. So Sissy Charlotte's just getting excuses in early. <laughs> she knows she's shit and she can't compete against me. There's Sylvie doing a little leg wiggle snowboard <laughs> thing she does. But look at the view behind her. This is what working in the Alps is all about. Is now we're going to go and deck Charlotte on the floor. That's the fucking usual! <laughs> <laughs> Yo, do something cool, I'm recording. Do something cool. Oh god, don't don't go into me there. Oh, I can't hear you, I have my headphones there. Good morning. I am so excited. Today is going to be such a good day. Me, Sylvan, and Ass have got the day off, and it's Shelley who stay up tea, so obviously, like, and all our other friends have the day off. Um, and Griff's here, Ass's boyfriend, and we're going to do first tracks. I really hope I'm not, no, I don't think I am. I don't actually know where the speaker is here, but we're going to go do first tracks. Um, Everyone is still asleep, so I really hope you can hear me. I wanted to do this all season. I was going to do it for my birthday um, on the 8th of Feb because it only happens every Wednesday, and my birthday was a Wednesday, but then obviously I broke my wrist, so they wouldn't let me do it, like even just slowly boarding down or whatever. They were like, nah, you've got a cast on, so you can't do it. So I'm going to go do it now. It basically just means we've got to meet down there at like to eight and then they'll open the chairlift up and we can go to the top of the mountain and um, before anyone else gets there come down to make first tracks and then get some breakfast so yeah i'm so excited i actually thought it was a sunrise thing so maybe that'll have to be <laughs> another day because i thought that they take you up and then you watch sunrise from the top but this is just as good here we go it's so peaceful on a morning I'm going to keep showing you this view because I never ever ever get sick of it. We'll do like a two week vlog thing. Um, it's Tuesday, I don't think I've vlogged since last Tuesday, potentially Wednesday. Um, but my dad's here. So dad came to visit on Sunday, hence I'm in a nice hotel room. Um, I'm not staff for calm. The day is literally perfect, let me show you. I'll go out of the bed in a second. Um, oh, if I come across. So yesterday was like, we've had like white out for two days. And now this is the weather today. This is Mont Blanc. Oh, right there. So yeah, absolutely stunning. Um, yesterday, what did we do? So the first night dad was here, dad got us all absolutely wasted. Didn't get back till like four in the morning and yesterday was a struggle. Um, but we went, I did a couple of runs with my friends. Dad's not skiing because he's got a knee injury. 
Um, and we also did some little cafe hopping, had a nice dinner, went to the wellness center, which was lovely. Today is a jam packed day, which is why I thought I would pick up the camera. So we're gonna do the luge, which I think was the last time I vlogged when we did that with Griff. And we're also gonna do the zip line, which I think we're all a little bit scared for, but it should be okay. Um, you can either lay down like front facing or you can sit with another person next to you, which is what I'm gonna do. Dad, say hi, make an appearance. Hi everyone. Excited to be here? Yes. Scared hi. about zip, scared about luge, <laughs> but all good. Dad's got his ski pass. Oh. We're already pretending to lose it, are we? <laughs> so this is the town. I don't think I've ever showed you guys this town before, but this is 1950 where I live. Um, we went in there for dinner the other night. 10 out of 10, wasn't it, Dad? Yeah. Really <laughs> Best tiramisu ever. Um, you coming? We're gonna go find Dad a beanie. So yeah, this is literally it. This is 1950. It's stunning. Stunning, stunning, stunning. Let's go in here. Um, and find you a beanie, hey? All right, guys, this is my dream board. Okay, so it's the Burton. Oh, can you show you the one? Ah, go on, Dad, thanks. It's the Burton Feel Good. So yeah, that's the dream, Burton Feel Good, but I was just saying to Dad that board shopping for women is literally, this is it, versus men's. It's like clothes shopping for you guys. <laughs> Not ideal. We're on the very bubble. So the bubble was only open to pedestrians. I've not shown you guys, um, but there's been a shit ton of snow in the past two days. Um, so, so much snow, like the most snow we've had all season, and today's a bluebird. Um, but yeah, I think the pedestrian, this is only open to pedestrians because um, of avalanche risk. So I literally just had my board snatched out of my hands by the woman at the bottom. So let's hope, let's hope that's still there when we get back down. But to be honest, it works for us because um, me and dad want to go to the top of the mountain to Aglia Rouge, which I think was the last thing I actually filmed on this. But I'm going to take dad to Aglia Rouge to see the top of the mountain, the lookout point. This is the view. Oh, dad's got his little 360 camera out. Give us a wave. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's so, so good. So we've just got to the top of Vare and um, Aglia Rouge is shut. <laughs> so that's annoying because we wanted to go up there. But it might be open soon. There's a look, nice cafe there. We're going to go see if that's open. It doesn't look it, but it might be. But yeah, I think Aglia Rouge is closed because of how much snow there's been. I mean, this is just a little footpath that's cleared and yeah. <laughs> but absolutely stunning. Oh my God, so much snow. Look at this view. Wow. So yeah, usually this is a run here, but as you can see, it's just covered. So this like a is a little bit of better research. <laughs> oh dear. So this is the zip line we're meant to do later today. I don't think Dad's too keen. I think we're currently at 2,680 meters, but this tells you all the mountains. So Mont Blanc is 4,800 meters high, and that's it right there. But yeah, coffee time, Dad. No, I'm watching this one go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, On the way up it. to the zip line. How's yeah. everyone feeling? <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Loving life. <laughs> never better. So now I'm never. <laughs> Sending my mum a lovely text because I'm probably never going to see her again. <laughs> yeah, well, <laughs> yeah. Here we go. Well, if I can't me, breathe. I'm going to die before we get on it because it's going to be. I've never done a zipline like this in my life. <laughs> 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 Here we are. Before we go into the zip line. Say hello. Hi. Hello. Say hi. How are we all feeling, guys? I'm feeling better about Excited? Oh, you're all excited? No. It looked quite slow when she was going down. No, it didn't. Funny. It didn't. Well, I'm stopped it then. Right, you're not videoing on the zip line, are you? Oops. <laughs> Whoopsie. Yeah, we just found out that we we'll can't go head first. Yeah, I'm not allowed to go head first. Okay, guys, can I go without? No, you have to walk back up. Oh, oh. Uh, she's been very quiet. She's probably quite nervous, I think. No, I'm going to make her heavy breathing on my neck. <laughs> what, me? Why are you breathing on your neck? Oh, I'm doing okay. there. Smell you later. You know, I'm not going to go without. Okay. Smell you later. How do you feel, Charles? Scared and sick. Scared and sick. Mm hmm. Fun. <laughs> This is what we're going down. I feel sick. 
<laughs> I'm me. <laughs> I'm little. Now you can sit on your harness. Oh God! Oh God! Oh, wait, Stop right. Me. Oh, my head. Oh. <laughs> can you hold my hand, please? Move your hand. <laughs> oh, okay. Ah! Okay. It's okay. <laughs> Okay, no. yes, it's very important. Bend your knees and knees up. Uh, yes, like that. God. Okay, are you ready? Yes. Um, yeah. <laughs> Julie, au départ, j'ai un duo de 148 kilos. Um, he's got it. Yes. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. Emily's gonna send it. Send it, Emily! Wow! Oh, sense it, darling. Red or black? Um, I mean, red or blue? Blue? Yeah, blue. I'll meet you guys red. on the blue. I'm gonna swivel down red, the red. red, red. Could, do you think you can do it? I did it. Oh, okay then. I'm just I'm wondering what I want. Great technique by Sylv. I feel like the camera battery is gonna die any second now um but let's see how much we can film so unfortunately dad left this morning he left at like 4 a.m 5 a.m so I've just been really lapping up the hotel room to be honest and um, he's paid for the hotel room for the whole week so I feel so grateful because I can literally use this room as mine instead of going back to Staffacom until Sunday so yeah I'm gonna be staying in here and um, I've literally had this morning because I don't start work till 2 p.m it's 11 a.m at the moment I've had this morning to like chill I've edited my first vlog which I'm not gonna lie I'm so nervous to publish and put up like I, uh, I'm gonna post it and it's fine and I don't care what people say blah 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 but I am a little bit nervous <laughs> if people are gonna say stuff about it here I don't think they will though if they do whatever um I'm I'm feeling like I want to stand you guys up somewhere I'm lucky enough to have this room to stay in for the next few days which will be really nice um it just means I can have some of my own space like here is so intense the moment you open your eyes to the moment you close your eyes you're switched on and like talking to people so yeah this morning I've edited my vlog had a shower had dyed my eyebrows um I really need to go get, grab my moisturizer because I'm feeling really like my skin feels just so dry um and I want to tan tonight and stuff but yeah I've got like two till six and I'm literally using today as a chill day which I never have on season like I'm always outside so today I'm exhausted I've drunk so much alcohol my dad is such a massive alcohol feeder like we drink a lot here anyway, but with dad being here, he's just like, every time there's not a drink in my hand, one's put in my hand. So I'm completely run down and burnt out. Today is just like, the snow's rubbish anyway. It's really, really bad. I went out yesterday and it was just like, it felt like you were trying to board on cellar tape. Like I was just getting stuck. So we had all that lovely snow, but then it rained loads and it's too warm. So as soon as we get my snow, it just 
disappears within a couple of days anyway. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd show you the hotel room. I've had the best time. This vlog, I have no idea what it's going to be like. I don't know what I filmed. It's very sporadic um, over the course of the past two weeks. But I thought I'd just show you the hotel room. It is a mess. You come in from here and we have some little hooks on my coffee cup. It's great. Anyway, this is the bathroom. Lovely. So these are the rooms that I have to clean the weeks I'm on housekeeping. I don't know if I've even explained my job to you, but we're either on housekeeping or restaurant. So yeah, the weeks we're on housekeeping, we have to clean these rooms. Um, you come around here. These are two twin beds, but like I've just pushed them together to lay across them comfy. I'm gonna grab a double duvet for myself. Um, and yeah, we have a little desks up here, telly. And then this is the best bit. So this is the balcony. I'm not going to go outside because I've got no shoes on. But you can see it's been raining and it's literally melted all the nice snow away. Like this was covered. The balcony was covered. Like it had to be snow cleared. And now it's just looks like this. But anyway, bit of a white out today so you can't see much. But this is usually a view of Mont Blanc. So Mont Blanc's all across here. So pretty. So stunning. I'm going to miss it. Shh. <laughs> so so much the rooms that look onto the piece are actually more expensive whereas for me if i was staying here i'd want a, the view of mont blanc so so i'm about to go out skiing but well boarding but before i close this video up um which i'm going to do now because it's currently saturday and tomorrow is transfer day so this vlog's been over the course of like the last two weeks um i wanted to show you my new goggles i got these for 34 euros because the store had a discount a uh, destock sorry destock sale they're so they're so blue and reflective. They're this brand, Torrent. But yeah, 34 euros, how sick. So I'm going to use them now for the first time. Um, these are the ones I have at the moment. And they're, they're cool. Like, they go with everything. But they're not as, they're not as cool as that. So I'm going to put them on my helmet. I love them. They're a bit wonky at the moment. I'll try and sort that out. Oh, they look sick. Oh, my God. yeah they look so cool i'm gonna go boarding now so that's the end of this video i hope you're enjoying the vlogs like seriously if you are let me know um but yeah if you want to stick around subscribe and like and everything and i've got three weeks left here now which is mad um i think one or two more weeks of guests and then a shutdown week so literally not long left um thinking about the future planning for the future which is really tricky um i think summer plans might be italy but we'll see 